Guillain-Barr syndrome, GBS, and chronic inflammatory demyelinating polyneuropathy, CIDP, are two possible causes of peripheral neuropathy, a nerve damage condition characterized by numbness, tingling, or weakness in the hands and feet. Diabetes is the leading cause of peripheral neuropathy. However, neurological disorders like GBS and CIDP can also be the culprit. What is GBS and CIDP? Guillain-Barr syndrome and chronic inflammatory demyelinating polyneuropathy are two types of neurological disorder. The main distinction between the two is the timing of their onset. GBS tends to have a rapid onset, reaching its most severe state within four weeks. CIDP, on the other hand, is a chronic autoimmune neuropathy, meaning it progresses much more slowly and lasts longer. Both are autoimmune disorders that cause damage to the myelin sheath that surrounds the axons of peripheral nerves, which ultimately causes the damage that brings on the discomfort associated with peripheral neuropathy. Causes. GBS often occurs following a gastrointestinal viral infection. CIDP can be associated with various other illnesses, such as chronic hepatitis, diabetes, HIV AIDS, immune system disorders due to cancer and an overactive thyroid. The immune system's response to these conditions, along with other factors, can cause damage to the myelin sheaths that protect the axons of peripheral nerves. Damage to the myelin sheaths leads to symptoms of peripheral neuropathy. Symptoms of peripheral neuropathy that are associated with GBS and CIDP. The onset of weakness, numbness, or paralysis in the arms, legs, face, and breathing muscles, fatigue, tingling or numbness in the fingers and toes, and loss of deep tendon reflexes. Treatments. Potential treatments include blood transfusions, medication, supportive care, and physical therapies. Patients who receive proper treatment in a timely manner are more likely to avoid a significant amount of disability as a result of these conditions. If you are experiencing any of the above symptoms or suspect you may have Guillain-Barre syndrome or chronic inflammatory demyelinating polyneuropathy, contact a medical professional right away for a full evaluation and diagnosis. Read Understanding the Link Between Guillain-Barre Syndrome, CIDP, and Peripheral Neuropathy on our blog. Subscribe now. Learn more about peripheral neuropathy, our drug and clinical trials in our newsletter.